you're starting to observe. Uh, Jim, from uh, from uh, professional large observatories, uh, what what is the process now, and what sort of things he, will you be looking for? And then we'll turn over to Errol with the the citizen science, and then well for for the radio. Yeah, well, I mean, I know that a lot of people are excited about Rubin, and it is, it's had its first uh, look and first light images come out just a couple weeks ago. This object is passing through the commissioning field, and so we, I, we, my understanding is we do have a handful of observations of it. They're not processed and released yet, but um, it's really exciting for us that in the very first weeks of this 10-year survey, we have the perfect test case just passing right through. Nature has been very kind to us this year. Um, from a from a professional oops, excuse me, from a professional development standpoint, I think this is going to be a really good test of all of our resources, from follow up equipment to spectroscopy to everything that we need to understand the composition of this object. So uh, mm -hmm. it's going to be all hands on deck with this and anything else that comes flying through in the next couple of months.